you guys what's up welcome back to my channel it's your girl Cree in today's video I want to show you guys the new clean fragrances I picked up that I have added to my collection that I am loving literally these have become true loves and so I just had to share them with you guys on my channel I plan to pull for these in the spring and summer and I have already been pulling for them non-stop so I just had to bring them to my channel so if that sounds like something that you guys would like to see let's get into it First up, we got Clean Reserve Radiant Nectar. Now, I know you guys have already heard about this fragrance. This is not new to YouTube, but it's just new to me. Um, I did smell this fragrance in the store. I don't remember it being something that I felt like I loved or had to have. However, I did get a sample one time. I think it was a roll-on with one of my Sephora orders. And at that time, I felt like it was decent. Well, I found it at a good price and I was like, well, I'm going to go ahead and get it so i went ahead and picked up this fragrance and you guys i've had it a couple weeks and look at the dent already so if i'm being honest i did not love this fragrance it was not a love at first sniff it was an okay and then actually <laughs> um when i actually picked this up i was like mm, this isn't how i remember it and so if you guys know i'm going to show you the notes up here um, I was put off by the fruit in the beginning. So there is a pear note in here. I don't know all of the notes off rip you guys, but I do know that there is a pear note in the opening because it is very obvious, very detectable, and it is very literal. Um, there is a like very juicy syrupy pear in the beginning and I didn't like it at first. It took me couple of weeks <laughs> to get accustomed to that pear and it's funny because I actually love pears you guys in real life it's, it's one of my favorite fruits especially when it's good and ripe oh my goodness I love a pear but um oh, you guys I'll tell you even if you're not like the biggest fan of pear if you wait until it dries down because the opening of it is strong you get a very literal pear with a lot of sweetness trailing behind it but as it dries down it just turns into this really soft and pretty scent that i can enjoy and i like it i really do um it's not much to it and i actually find that this is good to pair with the other ones that's really what's giving me the dent is that i've been pairing it with one of the other scents so we're gonna move on to that but you guys this is a win for me now if you love a pear scent this is absolutely something you're gonna want to reach for it's really really nice but you have to like it sweet and you have to like it fruity you have to like that pear you, it's not really any getting around it you need to like that pair because you're going to detect you it. guys the next scent that i have is skin by clean reserve <sighs> listen i heard so many good things about skin before i picked it up for myself i don't know much about the notes in here i know that they have like praline there's a suede note i think there's salt as well in here and of course i'll leave that up there for you guys as viewing but i haven't put much of a dent in here i put a little dent but i am actually savoring this until i get a backup because yeah i'm about to be pulling for this so much when i first got it i said oh now i see what they're talking about this is so good literally your skin but better it's really nothing else to say it's like put it here <sighs> there is just like a fresh crispness almost get a little bit of like clean laundry but not really clean laundry on skin like i think it's that salt on the skin it's something about it that's a little beachy but not like aquatic in any way Oh, y'all, it just smells really good. Just like clean skin. I just, I love it. I absolutely love this. I think this would be good to layer. But even if it's just on its own, like I can just see this being pulled for so much in the summertime when it's really, really hot and you're sweating and you just don't want to smell like a perfume. You don't want to smell fruity. You don't want to smell gourmand. You don't want to smell sweet. You just want to smell good and clean. And that's what this gives me without smelling like full-on laundry detergent. I really love this scent. It's an easy grab. And I highly recommend it. If nothing else, I highly recommend it. Now this. we're down to the best one of them all. Y'all, this one here is my favorite. Last but not least, I have sparkling sugar. <sighs> you guys, when I tell you, first of all, let's look at the dent. 
look at the the dent it's it's gone i mean where's the juice y'all when i tell you i got one not one two not two three bottles of this backed up because it's that good and i'm not sponsored i bought all of these myself you guys when i tell you this is the best i got this in a sample about a month ago i think it was about a month ago randomly came in a sample with another fragrance that i bought i smelled it and i said oh my god this smells so good i knew i had to get it and i was waiting to find it on a discount website or something for the low and y'all the day never came i never found it like the way i found these other two i found these on fragrance net they're like less than half price of the retail but this i can't find this markdown it's like i think it's a little too new that said i saw reviews all over of people saying they went to tj maxx and that's where they found the scent so you know me <laughs> say less i'm on the way y'all i went to tj maxx found it don't went back about two three times had to pick it up because once I got this, I couldn't stop. First, I wanted to just try it out, but then I just became addicted to the scent. It is just so good. I think this has notes of like peach, cassis, or berries. Um, and then I'm assuming it's like a musk in the base. I think it's inbred. You guys, so, so good. I don't even get like a super peachy vibe or super fruity. It's just more of a sweet and fresh it's like clean reserve skin but with a little bit of sweetness as well it's a really interesting combination i really can't put my finger on but it's like a good sweet musk but it's not really really sweet like it's not sickeningly sweet to me it's sweet but it's also fresh and crisp i have no idea how to describe this scent all i know is that it's so so good and it is addictive I didn't hear anybody say anything like this because I have seen reviews, but honestly, to me, there is something a little unisex about this. Even though it is sweet and it's called sparkling sugar, I know you guys wouldn't expect that out of a scent by that name, but there is something in there that is a little unisexy to me but i like it i really really do not everybody's gonna catch it so don't let it scare you off don't worry about it but y'all amazing so far one of the best buys of 2024 for me hands down i gotta say and so yeah and at the discounted price that i got it for which is 35 dollars i bought this at tj maxx you can't beat it that said i have paired this with both of these scents but mostly i've been pairing it with radiant nectar this is what has made me really like radiant nectar for a while i saw people say when i was trying to decide which one i wanted to get i saw people say that radiant nectar was like very similar to this in my opinion they're pretty different um that pair really stands out in here like in this i couldn't tell that it was peach but i found that out by looking at the notes but this you can truly detect that pair is really in your face um but in the dry down it gets better and it just turns into something really sweet matter of fact i think this is sweeter than this personally and it lasts longer so i figured well why not pair them together when i paired them that was a match made in heaven you guys the pair kind of eased to the back instead of it just being a pear scent went ahead and added this in and so the pear and the peach it just gave me a magical fruit bowl and <laughs> I just love it. It's just such a pretty effortless scent combination. And I'm telling you, I will be pulling for this so much this summer. <laughs> this spring and summer, this is going to be my go-to, but definitely in the summer heat because y'all, I don't be trying to smell all fruity and all that. Like I'm going to give y'all combos and stuff, but this is going to be my go-to. Believe that. And so y'all, that wraps up this video. So this was just a quick little video, just introducing y'all into the clean fragrances that I just recently added to my collection. And if you guys have any of these, definitely let me know down below which one is your favorite. Do you lean towards Radiant Nectar, Skin, or Sparkling Sugar? Or is there another one that I need to look out for? Definitely let me know down below and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.